Hi everybody, how are you guys doing today? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Edith. How are you today? I am going to show you how to make Zobo drink. Zobo drink is made with happy scots flour. So I am going to the store to get the supply. I need the happy scots flour, I need pineapple, and I need meat. Okay, meat leaves. So follow me as I go to the store to get all the supply. Stay tuned. Oh, hi everyone, we're here now, so I'm here to pick up the recipe. So I am right here in the store to pick the supply for the sobo drink. Like I told you, I said we need happy sports flour, we need milk and we need pineapple. So I'm gonna pick my mix right now. Here is it. Okay, then now we're gonna go pick the pineapple. Yeah, we need pineapple. Then I'll take you to go pick the happy sports flour. Those are the supply that we need. Hi guys, I just remember that I have a hibiscus flower in the house. So let's go home and let's start the procedure to make the Zobo drink. Alright, stay tuned. Bye. Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm going to show you how to make healthy Zobo drink. So I went to the market today to buy all this stuff. So this is the Zobo we need. Uh, meat. And if you want to add honey, add honey. If you don't want to, it's okay. And um, pineapple. So before we start, I want to tell you the benefit of Zobo. It's made with hibiscus flour. So this is hibiscus flour, guys. So hibiscus flowers, this drink I'm going to make, it helps to lower cholesterol. It helps to lower blood pressure. For those that are struggling with hypertension, this is good for you, okay? And also, it has anti-cancer properties. It also has antibacteria, anti-inflammatory agents, and also antidepressant agents. Okay guys, so let's dive into it. These are my ingredients. I'm gonna wash this, okay? We need two cups of this um, Zobo. A piece of flour, we say. Two cups of it, okay? That's your soap. Here we go. This is it. I bought it from the local shop. Okay. So this is two cups of this hibiscus flour. You're going to put it in water. Make sure you wash it very well. Okay. Watch. Wash it really, really clean before you put it in the pot. And if you, I use four cups of water to boil to make this double drink. All right, so now this is uh, four cups of water. Put your zobo in the pot. Okay, so that's it. Then now your pineapple. So, I'm going to use half of this pineapple, guys. Make sure you wash it very well because we're using the skin too, okay? Then I will boil it for 20 minutes. So this is organic mix, okay? Please, I love using organic, so use organic, okay? Mm. 
Make sure you wash it, then just chop it up. Add it, cover it, and put it in 20 minutes. So stay tuned, I will be back with the final results. Hi everybody, so welcome back. I told you guys I'm gonna cook this Zobo drink for 20 minutes. So it's ready. So the next thing to do, can you see it? The color is like ruby red. The next thing to do is to filter this. Filter it. So this is my filter here, guys. Alright, so let's do it. Very good drink, right? So let's let it cool down. I will go back for the final results. All right, guys, I am back with the Zobo drink. It's ready, guys. So welcome back. Um, this is the Zobo. It's ready. I'm just gonna put honey. If you like to put sugar, whatever you like, just put in. But me, I'm using honey. <laughs> Put some ice into it if you want to drink it with ice, or you can drink it if you want. Okay. I have it in this bottle here for the family. So I'm going to put this in the fridge, then we're going to be drinking it. So let's test it. Hmm. Well, it only tastes good, okay. So, get your hibiscus flower, get your pineapple, get the mix, and make this sobo drink for you and the family. Especially for those who have issues with high cholesterol, hypertension. Okay? So, tendon, eat healthy, live healthy, and be healthy. Bye for now.